In this video, we will be studying about the data and the individual series. See, whenever we collect some data, it is in a raw form. You call it as a raw data. A mass of data in its crude form is called raw data. Which means, see, you have collected a data which means the marks obtained by the students in class 9th. You have collected this data and you get the marks of student that is 30, 25, 15, 30, 25. 20, 10, 45, 20, 10, 40, 20, 10, 30, 25, 15, 30, 20, 15 and so on. So this is a raw form of data. You cannot analyze anything from this data. The data presented are raw data. These are not homogeneous data or the data classified into different groups. So this is just a raw form of data. So you call it as a raw data. Now we have the other thing to understand is series. Now what are series? When raw data are classified in the order or sequence is the Series. When you classify your data in the different classes or in order or sequence then it is called series. Now how you convert into statistical series. See how you convert your raw data into the statistical series. So we have two types of statistical series. Number one is your individual series. Number two is your discrete series or you call it as the individual series are series without frequencies or the other series we have series which are further classified into two types that are your discrete series or frequency arrays or you call them as frequency array then you have frequency distribution Or you call it as also continuous series. So in this video we will be studying about the individual series. Number one comes your individual series. Now let's understand what are your individual series. See, when your data is listed singly that is you have written serial number you have written the marks obtained by students in 9th standard and you keep on writing that is your individual CD so individual series you can write it as those series in which 
the items are listed singly means on single single it is listed so number one we can uh, write the individual series according to the serial numbers like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and we will write the corresponding their marks or the other any attribute we want to write or according to the roll numbers second we have is ascending or descending order of data so the data which we have collected we might arrange that data into the individual series in a, in a simple ascending or descending order the smallest ascending means the smallest value is placed first while the descending means the highest value is placed first and it goes on uh, reducing in descending and increasing in ascending so your individual series are the series in which you write just like this 25 marks 30 marks 32 marks you write serial number oh, 63 marks then 89 marks then no uh, 31 uh, marks right. so this is your according to the serial number and this is your individual series now if you arrange them into the ascending order or descending order then also it will be the individual series now let's arrange to the ascending order where, where that is the small bigger bigger and bigger small is 25 then 30 then 31 then 32 then 63 and then 89 and if I talk about descending then it is 89 63 32 31 30 and 25 so the ascending or the descending order of data so this is your individual series i hope you have completely understood about the data and the individual series to download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us